Hello guys, I hope you all are doing great. We're back. After its first attempt failed, Xiaomi seems ready to try again, and rumors are heating up. Conflicting reports suggest the chip is built either on TSMC's N3 or N4P process. However, reliable leaker Jukunlos Reve claims it's the N4P node, more cost-effective and easier for Xiaomi to manage. The CPU layout reportedly features one Cortex-X925 core at 3.2 GHz, three Cortex-A725 cores at 2.6 GHz, and four Cortex-A520 cores at 2 GHz. This configuration is decent, especially for a first ARM V9 chip, but it leans more toward mid-range performance. A debut in 2025 seems likely, possibly with a phone like the Xiaomi 15S. Graphics will be powered by the Imagination Technologies IMG DXT72 GPU at 1.3 GHz. Xiaomi is expected to use its own ISP, but other elements like the DSP and 5G modem will likely be sourced from partners such as MediaTek or Synopsys. There's even a chance Xiaomi could turn to domestic suppliers like Huawei for some components. While it may not rival flagship chips just yet, Xiaomi's move to develop an in-house SOC is strategic. It could offer better supply chain control and long-term flexibility. This marks an exciting shift in the Android landscape. In addition to that piece of news, the Poco M7 Pro 5G, launched in Europe and the UK after its release in India, combines hardware from the Redmi Note 14 series, but with notable global market adjustments. The device is powered by the MediaTek Dimensity 7025 Ultra chipset, paired with a 6.67-inch AMOLED display offering 1080p resolution, 120Hz refresh rate, and 2100 nits peak brightness. It comes with 8GB of LPDDR4X RAM, 256GB of UFS FS 2.2 storage and a 5110 milliamp hour battery with 45 watt wired charging. Unlike the global Redmi Note 14 5G, which boasts a 108 megapixel primary camera, the Poco M7 Pro 5G uses a 50 megapixel Sony LYT600 camera with optical image stabilization, an f1.5 aperture, and a 1 slash 1.95 inch optical format. It also includes a 2 megapixel depth sensor and a 20 megapixel front facing camera. The Poco M7 Pro 5G is available in two versions 8 gigabytes of RAM with 256 gigabytes of storage priced at 140 pounds. A 12 gigabytes of RAM option is also available for 180 pounds during the same period, and please consider that these prices are scheduled to rise to 199 pounds and 239 pounds after this promotional period ends. Xiaomi is also offering launch discounts, including a deal on the SmartBand 9 Active in the UK. You may visit Xiaomi's website for more details. That wraps up the discussion for today. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. If you guys are new here, don't forget to subscribe. The tech chat is over and I am out.